tonight you had a major leaguer, uh, Miguel Rojas, at, at shortstop. First, how did he look out in the field? Well, I thought he looked good. All his pregame looked like he got everything done. We took infield, outfield. Um, you know, it's in the thumb. The uh, ball's coming out good on the throw. Um, and he played nine innings in the field. You know, had the double play ball, had the, the ground ball late, made some nice throws, and, you know, he ended up going to the plate five times tonight. And uh, at the plate, uh, he had a couple of moments, uh, situations where he did his job moving runners. What was the significance of his plate appearance? Well, you know, the first time up, you know, he moved moved uh, Brax over, and Andy got him in right away to get us on the board. And then, you know, great sacrifice bump. Uh, the last time, you know, Scott's got filthy stuff, and he's not easy to hit, let alone bump. But, uh, you know, it's just good, good to get him to the plate. Um, you know, and, and, you know, when he returns to the big club, those situations are probably good preparation for him. And that's why we decided to kind of play it that way right now. We discussed it, and we were all on the same page. What's next for him? Uh, he's going to play tomorrow. He's going to play nine innings tomorrow at first base and hit the top of the lineup. And, and then, you know, we hit the road. So, uh, you know, something, something good, I'm sure, will be coming his way. A good night uh, for Chris Mazza on the mound. He was able to endure and also contributed uh, at the plate getting something started. Yeah, well, you know, Maz took that, that liner off the, the leg and sucked it up and, and dealt for six innings. And then, you know, the big bunt got it started that inning, legged it out, scored the run. So um, it was pretty awesome for him to gut it out and pitch six innings, holding the three runs, quality start, plus, get, you know, get that rally started there, especially after taking that missile off the leg. Uh, back at the top of the lineup, Braxton Lee, uh, three hits. Uh, what did you see from him getting back there tonight? Well, you know, when he goes, we go. So, um, you know, he laid down a couple nice bunts, you know, got the ball through the infield, uh, hit the ball squared left field. You know, right now, you know, he's, he's going pretty good right now. Uh, last couple innings uh, uh, unfolding is similar to a couple nights ago. Um, uh, what was the preparation needed for your team there? Well, I think the bullpen was awesome throwing those zeros up. You know, I mean, as soon as, uh, you know, Beltre guy came in the game and then Danny and then, you know, Morty, you know, quick outs. And that's the name of the game for those guys came in, just snuffed it out right away, get the offense at the plate. And that's when we got a chance to come out on top and leave them standing on the field tonight. And the bullpen's uh, been pretty strong uh, this this whole series. Any factors that have led to that? Shoot. Um, you know, I, I, I think they're just, you know, throwing pitches with commitment and conviction and coming in there and snuffing out the fires. And, I mean, they know. I mean, it's a tough, tough job. And uh, it's not that easy. And, uh, you know, they're, you know, here we are 90 games into it, and they're doing a good job right now. Well, good job tonight on the win. Congratulations. Okay. Thanks for joining us. All right. Thanks, Marco.